Hello and welcome, this is Kendra, and today I'm sharing another two sheet wonder file for the new Card Cut Essentials dies one and two that are available for purchase at Pink and Main. Each of these die sets include a big 6x6 six six die that will cut a full sheet of 6x6 six six paper in one pass through a die cutting machine and give you a bunch of different shapes that you can use to create different card layouts. It also includes additional shapes and banner dies. These were released on August 16th of 2024 and I shared a free PDF digital download called Two Sheet Wonder Number 1 that included six sketches showing how to cut two sheets of pattern paper with these dies, using up all of the pieces, leaving no scraps. If you missed my introduction video when the new release products launched, I will link that above and in the description box so you can learn more about how I created these dies and check out all of the cards that I created. There are two different dies that you can purchase individually, but you can also get these as a bundle at Pink and Main. What's great about the bundle is that you also get a free download that contains 56 card sketches for ideas on how to use the pieces included in the dies, and this comes straight from Pink and Main. This die set is great for beginner card makers and those who enjoy creating cards using pattern paper. If you get card making kits each month, these dies help you to make lots of cards. I love that it includes these separate shapes so you can layer the fishtail banners, plus you get several different size hearts, stars, and hexagons. Most of the dies included have stitching also. It comes with a word and shadow die that says hello in this scripty font and a zigzag circle plus a zigzag border strip. And I love that you can use these square shapes from both die sets to create shakers. I'm using this paper pad here called Be Kind from Pink and Main and I'll be showing the finished cards for the two sheet wonder file number two. I actually cut up these 10 sheets of paper using the dies so that I could mix and match the patterns to make a bunch of cards. If you've been a subscriber to my channel for a while, you know that I like to make cards in bulk and I try to use up all of the pieces so that I don't have any scraps left over. So I also used this Pink and Main stamp set. This is called Hap B Fall. This is the stamp of the month for August of 2024 and it did have coordinating dies. And I also used a sentiment from this stamp set here called Sweet as Honey. Now, while I show you all of the cards that I created using the two sheet wonder file number two, I wanted to mention that this is a part of a giveaway hop. Members of the Kendra's Card Challenges design team will be sharing creations using these Card Cut Essentials dies. And all you need to do to enter is complete the form that's linked in the description box before September 5th. I'll be randomly selecting the winner after the hop ends and will announce it on my YouTube channel under the community tab. So make sure you're a subscriber and turn on those notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads or posts. Now this card that I'm putting together here is card sketch number two and it's just very simple. As you can see, I've glued this down at a diagonal and trimmed off the edges. And here I'm just going to place this zigzag circle with the stitching on it in the middle and add the sentiment and the B and super cute. Now the rest of these, I am using the sketches from the two sheet wonder. I do have an embossed panel on a lot of these in the background and I feel like that adds a lot to the design, but I think these are super cute. But I wanted to mention that this PDF is available to download for free by all access and VIP patrons over in my Patreon shop. If you're not a paid member of my Patreon program, you can purchase this digital download for only $3. I will have the link directly to this file over in the description box below. If you'd like more information about becoming a member of my Patreon membership program, you can visit patreon.com forward slash Kendra's Card Challenges. This is sketch five and I just took that window die and placed it at an angle and I added the square piece on top and before I glued it down, I cut out the center part of the window and then I just trimmed off the edges. Now I'll have another two sheet wonder file that I'll be posting in the next few weeks. And if you haven't purchased these dies yet, the links to the Card Cut Essentials dies are also listed below in the description box. And these are affiliate links, which means if you make a purchase, I earn a small commission at no extra cost to you. And this helps to support my channel. To hop along to get lots of card making inspiration using these dies, 
click on the playlist that's in the description box. You can enter the giveaway for each video that you watch along the hop for more chances to win. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoy the hop. Happy crafting!